In this video, I'll show you how to generate a YouTube or TikTok news channel in less than two minutes, all with the help of AI. Well, that's great news. I'll take you through everything you need to know step by step, so let's get started. We'll be using Google News as an information source for this example, but you can use any other news sources. Depending on the channel you create and the niche you want to focus on, you can choose a specific news category, for example, technology or business, or you can just go for general interest news. In this case, though, we'll focus on technology, so let's take a look at today's top stories. Now, let's open Flixir Video GPT. It's a very easy to use tool, especially if you've used ChatGPT before. So, let's start making our video. First, we'll pick one of the news articles from Google News and copy the link to it. After copying the link, we can go back to Flixir, and here we'll find several options. We can import images, select the length of the video, and there's also a link option. I'll choose the link option and then paste in the article URL. At this point, Flixir will import the article, summarize it, and rewrite it in its own style so you can use it in your videos. After the article is imported, you'll get the generated text. This is the script for your video. You can ask the AI to make it shorter or longer, or you can rewrite it. We'll make it slightly longer, and once the new version is generated, it's time to choose a voice. There are two types of voices. AI voices that sound super realistic, like Charlie, Willy, or Joe here, or you can clone your own voice. To do that, just click on Record New Clone Voice and follow the on-screen instructions. But for now, we'll just go with Joe's voice. At the top, there's four more options. Stock videos, AI images, AI videos, and website images. You should avoid using the website images options unless you're using your own articles to create your videos. That's because if you use it, Flixer will take the images from the article, and those might be copyrighted, so your video could end up being taken down. If you use AI videos instead, you don't run the risk of getting any copyright strikes. Great, now we just need to click Generate Videos, and then wait a few seconds for Flixer to do its thing. In just a few seconds, our video will be generated. You can see that the clips match the context of the voiceover pretty well. Now that the video is generated, we can start to customize it. You can disable these emojis and stick only with the captions. There's also a library of templates that you can use for your captions, just pick the one you like the most. And if you want to remove the subtitles completely, that's also an option. Next, you have the Media tab. Here you can see all the videos generated for your project and you're free to replace any of them. If you think that one doesn't fit, just click Replace. You'll see the prompt that was used to generate the original clip and you can tweak it however you want or replace the video with stock media or your own footage. You can also change the voice easily, and if you want to take things to the next level, you can click Edit More to open the full Flixier editor. Now in here, you can add and tweak transitions, add extra text, background music, effects, and a lot more. But if you're happy with the way your clip looks, all you need to do is click on export. In less than 3 minutes, your video will be ready to share on social media. Until next time, happy editing!